congenital insensitivity to pain with anhydrosis. CIPA Genetic Disorder Project Presented by Ibrahim Chaudhry and Nixon Joala Prasad The Cause Congenital insensitivity to pain with anhydrosis or CIPA is a very rare genetic disorder which occurs because of nerve cells not doing their job correctly. Nerve cells are very important in your body. When you are hurting yourself nerve cells send a message to your brain. Your brain sends a sharp pain to warn you that you are hurting yourselves. CIPA is caused by a problem by a mutation in the NTRK1 gene also known as TRKA. This gene produces proteins called NTKR. CIPA is an inherited recessive genetic disorder trait. The Effect There are many symptoms of congenital insensitivity to pain with anhydrosis or CIPA. One symptom is that you do not feel any pain. CIPA is a genetic disorder when you do not feel any pain. So if you do not feel pain you may have CIPA. Another symptom you get during CIPA is decreased temperatures. Also decreased sweating called anhydrosis. These symptoms are also known as autonomic neuropathy type 4. People who are diagnosed with CIPA live through their adulthood, which is around 30 years old. Most people who have CIPA their onset begins when they are born. If not then when they are around 5 years old. CIPA is a rare genetic disorder. The treatment. CIPA sounds like a terrible nightmare. If you have CIPA you wouldn't feel any pain. So your brain wouldn't warn you that you are hurting yourself. Then you would be damaging yourself a lot. Scientists around the world are trying to find a cure to this nightmare. So far currently there is no cure to CIPA. The treatment is currently focused for CIPA. The best thing to do if you have CIPA is do physical therapy every day. Extra information. There are a hundred people in this world that had CIPA. There are five types or stages of CIPA. Each stage gets more dangerous. CIPA is happened when just one out of a billion proteins get messed.